Okay, here we go. This is the kind of pre-factory, not production prototype, but kind of check the sizing and the color correction and everything. So uh, this has been sitting for several days and I have not opened it. Look at how um, strong-willed I am. So I'm going to open, holy Toledo, this thing is like I got dropped out of an airplane at 50,000 feet. Strong-willed, you weren't strong-willed, you just had other stuff to do, like recover from 12 hours of driving. That's right, strong-willed, <laughs> I call that strong-willed. Look, ooh, I'm going to cut off my finger on film. Holy Toledo, okay, so, huh, huh, it's birth. The miracle of birth. Wow, they wrapped it. They knew this thing was going to gonna do well. Okay. That's it. That's the final packaging. Oh, wait. No, there's more. Ooh, bubble wrap. I'm going to murder all this bubble wrap. Holy Toledo. Maybe is there enough of a bubble wrap on this? This is a very exciting video. See how I'm clumsily opening up bubble wrap. <laughs> There's more. You're out of view, baby. I don't. I'm sorry. I'm out of view. I'm trying to. Ah. Ah. That's a little plain. I guess we gotta open it again. This is like one of those little like Russian dolls, and eventually it's just gonna be a single card on the inside. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, this box is heavy. So, oh, the box is very, very pretty. There's a glare. Get it a little bit. Sorry, how's that? There we go. A little bit more tilted up. Yeah. Down. There's this. Oh, pretty. Dude, it's a thick box. Stop a bullet. Okay, I think you put the expansion stuff in here. Oh, the sides of the boxes. Oh, these are just an examples of punches. Sorry, it's not the actual punches to the game, but look at the sides of the box. Can you see those? With all the different... You've got to tilt it. Like that, there we go. Yeah. All the different... Judges. Judges on the side of the box. Oh, that's so beautiful. It looks cool. This is just a mock-up. The rule book. Let's take a look at the rule book, shall we? Ooh, the rule book is really pretty. That's a good angle. Don't tilt it or the glare. Either. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to avoid the glare of our wonderful light. So, it looks really cool. We'll have to look through it really closely for last-minute spelling errors or anything. But, um, yeah, wow. it looks really, really pretty. It's nice. It's easy to... Oh, it's nice. And, it's big font. Because here's the thing. I have a thing about little tiny fonts that drive me crazy. So... Uh, this is a nice size font. Oh, what does this say in this post-it note? Punch board, uh, checking for quality. So this is just a punch board. This is the quality of the punch board they're going to do. So you can see it's, this is not for the game, obviously. This is some from other thing, but just the quality of the aqueous coating. Again, this is just a kind of a mock-up for collar correction and stuff. Maybe we should offer bonus points for some anybody who can identify what game those punch pieces are from. I have no idea what those are from. <laughs> uh, ooh, the board is really thick. Nice. Well, yeah, it's a three-point punch. Really nice and pretty. Oh, the stands. Oh my god, this box has... Oh, the insert's really nice, too. The oh, plastic wow. insert. Super nice. Um... This right here, these are the screens. Notice there's a red screen, and there's a white screen, and a blue screen. Sorry, I'm having it fall apart. And a yellow screen. And again, these are just as this is just a one time, the actual will have a much better aqueous uh, coating. But look, this is the little punches for the um, prizes, and the coins, and the spell tokens, and money. Some of them already fell in transit already. Um, yeah. This is a, get some extra. So these are, uh, looks like some more tokens. Let me see. Punch board checking for quality. Again, more punch board just to check. 
and oh look at the little people and everything's pink because it's not colored yet here are the actual colors so this is just to give you an idea of like the size and everything Ooh, the magic ingredients look really good again it's not the right color actually there would be some that would be this color they look real nice and the different um and the different people why don't you give us a close look close-up look oh here's some bags there's some bags just for color just to show it says for checking his, there's a look there's a heart post-it note on it too it says what checking the for checking the color of the wood pieces great i'll have to go through and check the color of these so oh this example of uh, cards with with finish. Yeah, it gives me an idea of what the card finish would look like. Oh, expansion card. So this is what, the, again, this is just hand cut. It wouldn't be the final production. It would not be, it would be shrink, shrink wrapped, not wrapped like this. But I want to see what they look like. Dude, this is like a exercise in knife wielding. <laughs> That's what this is. Just don't cut yourself, dear. Or the cards. Oh, don't cut the game cards. I'm going to use these cards when we go to... Um, no, wait. I know. You would rather cut yourself than cut the cards. I know you. I would. I'd much rather cut myself. Oh, they look really pretty if I can get them out of this freaking bag. <laughs> Dude, I don't do it. You but... look nervous, dear. I am. I think I'm caffeinated. Um, oh. Oh, they're really cool. So... That's like the back that shows with the bar. Oh, it's the ends. So, and again, this just shows the different, um, I know you could put, can you see this? If I hold my hands up like this? Um, got to tilt it down more. Yeah, kind of. But you can see the diff, the different card backs that each race has a different card back. So here's the, don't worry about it. Kate. There's got to be a zoom. We don't need to zoom. Here, look. Here's this. I'll take some, I'll post some pictures. So here's the backs of the cards like this. See the, these, we're going to have to go through every one of these cards. There's the gnomes. I love the gnomes. One of my favorite races, the backs of the pixies. So these look great. Um, I think we're going to use these. Oh, look at how it stores all the cards with ease. Cause my big concern was I wanted to be able to have all the cards be stored without having to, um, Without having to have bags, because I like my cards. Um, and there's enough slack in here that these could have sleeves. So if something was important to me, look, if these were sleeved, they'll still fit in here. Again, temporary wrapping job. These are um, vent cards. These are recipes. Oh, the recipe cards look really good. Judges. Um, event decks. Sorry. Oh, my God. These, that's that... The, again, this is a lot thinner. That's uh, the core races of the deck. That's 17, 16 races, 18 races. I forget. We're going to be using this set to play with. You know that, right? Oh, yeah. I expect it. I'm sorry. It's not the most it's not the most exciting uh, video in the world. Wow, it's a lot of cards. So, yeah, they look really, really nice. Look at the backs of those cards. They're beautiful. Yeah, they look really, really nice. Oh, van the vampires. They're very scary. Uh, orcs. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Sorry, I'm having... I need a little quick camera set up. Oh, ogres. I hope my hands are clean. Probably not. Uh, oh, yes. I have some. The naga. Uh, oh, the, the merfolk backs. People's favorites. Yeah, those look really, really nice. Wow, these different card backs are incredible. Um, and humans and giants and goblins and anyway, tons of cards. I want to drop them like Tom Vassell, <gasps> but I will not. No. <laughs> I will not drop them. Uh, this is a show example of the kind of bags for bagging com components. There's some stuff that popped out. And again, I don't know if you really want me to go through. This shows... um. 
different kinds of lamination and linen card stuff that we still have to make a couple decisions on. Yeah, I think maybe just posting pictures later. Yeah, I just wanted to show it live. This is very exciting. So the time frame on this is that we need a couple, probably two days to look through all these cards. Mm -hmm. Oh, I failed. Um, the last chance to find errors to correct them. And... Uh, and then we already have a couple rule book name adjustments, which I need to make because I got people's names wrong because I'm awesome. <laughs> and uh, well, I just, you know. And then, uh, wow, there's lots of room for expansion. Look at this. We can have another 15 races come out nice. in the years that follow. Nice. Um, yeah, and this just shows people and the shapes. These are the shapes of the magic ingredients. This is the shapes of the warts. The, oh, I'm making things fly everywhere. Uh, those are um, the people. Somewhere, you know, and then it just shows the different colors. You just wanted to see the different colors, brown. Oh yeah, that's the the purple and the blue and the red. Where's the? I don't see an orange in there, but I'm sure it has an orange in there. Um, so. That is very exciting. I'll probably have to... It goes together really nice in the box, especially all of this stuff. And I, didn't, I didn't take apart the screen, which I'll probably will take some screens apart, but as far as manufacturing-wise... Yeah, look at this. This is a temp This is, again, this is a handmade box. This is not the final box. They just made this wrap, just to kind of show. Um, yeah, it goes together nice and tight, even with the rule book. Should I pull one? Of, should I pop one of these screens out? Oh, the screens are really nice and thick. Wow, better than my um, hand constructed prototypes. <laughs> I'm gonna work on the, the other. Yeah, look at. I can't see how thick thick that is, but yeah, you can. Very nice. And then this. Let's see how the. Uh, again, this is you know hand done. Very nice. The little gnomes. The little gnomes, and then you'd be like, let's see how this fits together. This is the $10,000 question. I think I would tighten it a little bit, I think, will be my feedback. If you can, if they can make it a little bit tighter, but it's still pretty I don't good. Know. I think it's good that it's loose because then you can spread it more. And you know what I mean? Yeah, you're right. The looser it is, the yeah, more it's you totally can good. Spread it. Yeah. I'm, oh, what's this? Does this card get loose? Uh, I guess. I... Sorry, no, it was over here. I put it over there. Um, look, I'm behind my little screen. Can you see my <laughs> unshaven face? <laughs> I'm making. Oh, some, come on, show I'm us making, your face. <laughs> I'm making some beer. I don't. I haven't combed my hair. Um, Nobody cares. You never work. comb your hair. I don't. I'm like <laughs> I have hair right now. Um. Yeah, this this is super super nice. I'll bring this to Kublacon. Um We'll have to actually play with this set, though. I don't have to have the colored meeples. I'll have to get some colored meeples. Don't show my face. <laughs> and uh, we'll reveal the rule book. Um, it's okay, honey. We love your face. Yeah, how does it look with the color? Yeah, it looks pretty good, huh? Dude, it looks really good. Like. I'm impressed. The pieces look really, really nice. Well, this the is their quote-unquote rough hand cut just for color, but the color looks, the color looks spot good. on. Yeah. The blue piece, round pieces, the color was, seemed a little weird to me. Um, I need it to be lighter for, um, yeah, lighter color blue. I picked the, or the, the blue. I'll have to double what, check. But what, where do we use those? round like that big that's not a piece no, no. Okay. that's yeah. just, the, just color, the color not the color. pieces no oh, okay the tall cylinders mm -hmm. so what we blue? don't even have those cylinders it's just no, for know. the that's colors what I was saying. but what what blue what's the blue color the blue colors for the grains we have blue red yellow for the grains we have orange oh, but i thought it was going to be the dark blue no you changed it to a, a lighter, lighter blue. blue it looked better it's harder to see the difference from purple oh and then you have purple discs Orange discs, yeah. green disc, yeah. and then you have a hexagons. You have pink, white, black, white. And did I say white twice? Yeah. <laughs> and brown. <laughs> uh, and that's it. And you have all the tokens. So nice. I should put this back to so give you the illusion of. But it looks super nice. It does look really it's good. It's nice and thick. It's way thicker. It's actually about 25% thicker than I thought. 
Because, you know, you look at a spec, you're like, pick that color thickness of cardboard, and then you don't really know what that means until you, like, have it in your chubby little fingers. Um, yeah, the box is really heavy, too. Like, you know, I know, granted, we got a few extra of this stuff in here, but um, feel that box. I felt it. It's heavy. It's not a light. It's a great, this is a substantial game. And Remember, these, I picked it up from the post office so it wouldn't get sent back to did. China. And we, yeah, we don't want to get back to it. <laughs> yeah, the insert's super cool. Super, super nice. Like, the cards fit really nicely. And I know, you know, we looked at doing containers in here for the pieces. It just didn't work out. It just didn't work out well. So this ended up being um, a good option. At least I want the cards in the wells, and the rest of the pieces can be in bags or organizers. Well, and there's plenty of room for the pieces. Yes. It's important to me. I hate it when a box is tight. Like, if you get expansions, talked about adding another player expansion or whatever, more pieces, they have to be sell me in copies. And I think this will be black, not white on the back, I think it's supposed to be. Yeah. But, but actually, I kind of like white on the back, actually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, and these are for quality. So I have to, this is just, yeah, I don't know what this game is from, but I'm going to use these pieces. Dude, we should, like... <laughs> make a game with this right yeah. here. Yeah. Let's make a game it's out like, of It looks pieces. like Frogger, kind of. It does look like frog fogger. legs and yeah. mushrooms and spiderwebs. Yeah, yeah, they're they're really nice. He's concerned that these were only like laser cut temp temp temporary. These are, yeah, yeah they're just a are, nicer cut. You know, right, it's got the aqueous coating, and yeah, he well, he was very concerned that I wanted to make sure that he knew they could do it well. But it looks amazing. It does we'll have really to look good. through it in detail. Ooh, she's shiza. There's pieces all over the place. It's raining. Oh yeah, see these are <laughs> that's the magic pieces. I love hexagons. Love them. Oh, I can't fit it anywhere. Um, yeah, I really like the box. I'm going to have to spend some time reading it. Yeah, it looks good. You can read everything. Anyway, that's it. I'm going to post this online so everybody can see it. Adios. Adios, amigo.